It's a common complaint among many women. As they get older, their arms start to sag. Jason Carroll is live in West Hollywood with what you can do to arm yourself against flabby muscles. Jason? Well, Jonathan, it's pretty simple. There are a couple things you can do. You can diet, you can head out to your local gym to exercise, or you can head to a plastic surgeon. Millions of people have it, mostly women, and no matter how much they run, bike, or step, they just can't seem to get rid of it. I call it a swinging canopy. We call it Bubby Chopping Liver. There are lots of nicknames for them, angel wings, big arms. What it actually is, is genetically women are more likely to have fat settle in the back of their arms, making them somewhat saggy rather than spilt. You can be really skinny and still have a swinging hammock. It's All the exercise in the world will not tighten the overlying skin. Dr. Steven Teitelbaum is a plastic surgeon. He says liposuction could help in some cases or maybe try an upper arm lift. Just pinch that extra skin and remove that extra skin with a little incision that comes down here. These are the before and after pictures of a 30-year-old woman who had the procedure. Judge for yourself, a doctor's scalpel or sweat it off in a gym. And you should know that the cost of arm lift surgery can run anywhere between four and six thousand dollars. Obviously, the cost of a little bit of diet and some exercise at a gym will be much less than that. Reporting live from West Hollywood, Jason Carroll, CBS 2 News. Thanks for that advice, Jason.